I'm Paul Holofko and today we're going to be talking about controlling worms with your cabbage. Today we're in Alamany Farms, San Francisco, California in their wonderful cabbage patch. And you can actually see a lot of this cabbage looks really, really good. However, there are a few pests over here that we actually need to control. You can identify the pests simply by looking at the holes that might be cut in the leaves or, or part of the leaf is chopped off. The way you actually identify this particular pest with the worms is one you can see them in the worm form which is basically little white or green uh, worms or you can see them in the butterfly version of it for instance you i'm sure you've seen in the cabbage patch there's been uh, white little butterflies going around you can actually tell by if they're a boy or a girl by if there are two dots or, or four dots on them or you can actually tell by a a small little brown butterfly uh, that um, that really go, flitters around and, and goes around very, very quickly. The best way really to control these things is in their ferocious eating habits of, of stage of worms, where they have you can use diametaceous earth. And diametaceous earth is a small crystal that you just simply put around the cabbage itself, and you have to put it every several days. The worm goes over that, scratches it, and then gets infected and dies. You can get diametaceous earth really in any type of hardware store or a pool supply center. It's used roughly as a pool filter medium, or you can get them in a, in a hardware store, um, uh, really at, at any, any local place. Another way to control pests like the worms in your cabbage is to use BT. Now BT is a natural fungus that grows into the cuticles of the animal and grows from the inside out, destroying it. There's one caution with using BT. It is a non-selective type of pest control. In other words, your beneficial insects will also be killed as well as your problem pesky animals. So the way you use it is very simple. Take your jar, your bottle of BT, and you only need roughly about one ounce of it. I use a shot glass. Pour it in. That's basically all I really use. Put it in a sprayer. This is a pump-up sprayer that I use, that I get at any type of hardware store. Dump it in. Put the sprayer back on top. And spray basically anything you want. In other words, you can do the top of the leaf, the bottom of the leaf. Basically try to get all the sides of the leaf. And roughly in about a day or so, you'll find out your pest control is your pest has been totally eliminated. However, you have to remember that your beneficials will also be eliminated. I'm Paul Holofko.